My brother, Tyler Reese, is as unpredictable as a raging river. And like a raging river, when he decides which way he's going, there is no stopping him. I know this because the same blood is in me. For example, when I was in middle school, I went undefeated in wrestling with all pins. My brother saw this and wanted to do the same. Last year, he was in the 8th grade and held my exact same record, but better. Two of my matches went to the second period before I could pin my opponent, but he pinned everyone in the first period. Tyler is now a freshman in high school, and he has discovered a passion that no one in his family has influenced him to do in any way. My brother is a 15-year-old draft guy, and even though I would never say it to him, he is very good at it. Tyler was not his first time rafting, and the river was the big pigeon. I guess he instantly fell in love, for since that day there has not been any activity he enjoys more than paddling through whitewater rapids. He is a fast learner, and he kayaked Jacob Fork less than two months later. By the time he was 12, he was a raft guide coaching adults through treacherous waters. Tyler has only flipped a raft one time, and he says it's because the crew he was guiding had a lack of trust in him, because he was young. The crew didn't listen to his exact orders. Following directions is imperative on a dangerous river. Sometimes what the guide tells his passengers does not look or feel right to them, but they need to obey regardless. Since then, Tyler has successfully guided rafts and kayaks down the Tuckasegee, French Broad, Natahala, Big Pigeon, Ocoee, Wilson's Creek, New River Gorge, and the Gali. Most of these have dangerous Class 5 rapids and undercut rocks that claim several lives each year. Knowing this, not one member of our family is comfortable with the thought of Tyler pursuing this dangerous sport. However, like a raging river, there's no stopping him from using his natural talent to do what he enjoys the most.